Daily Devotionals for November 18th. Today's scripture reading will be Genesis 35, verses 9 through 12. Then God appeared to Jacob again when he came from Padam Aram and blessed him. And God said to him, your name is Jacob. Your name shall not be called Jacob anymore, but Israel shall be your name. Now, I want to stop there for a minute. You know, God at different times changes our name. I remember he first changed my last name. It was K-O-S-T. And I, many, I don't know, 30 years, whatever, longer than that, uh, I called it Coast. But one morning he woke me up. He was getting ready to send me to Alaska. And he woke me up saying, Bonnie Cost. And I felt like I was somebody I didn't know. But see, he was preparing to change my name to Jones, but I needed to get used to having a different name, okay? And then when I'm in Alaska, it was like January that year, he told me, this year I changed your name to Sarah. So he was changing my name to Princess, okay? Princess with God. And I thought that was pretty neat because it would be a season that I would be in. And I liked that name, Sarah. Okay, also God said to him, I am God Almighty, be fruitful and multiply. A nation and a company of nations shall proceed from you, and kings shall come from your body. See, God has so much, so much he wants to bless us with. I don't think we realize, you know, our fruitfulness comes from him. All the goodness and the, the greatness that he can do through us, everything proceeds from him he just does it through us and he says the land verse 12 the land which i gave abraham and isaac i give to you and to your descendants after you i give this land so all the promises that god has made even through your ancestors and i'm going to say personally for me it's like you know bob sowed a lot of seeds for many years you know 40 years before i knew him so he he did a lot of um cultivating the land, you know, spiritual souls. He was doing a lot of work. And I really get to step into the harvesting of the fields that, you know, from the seeds that he sowed. And God wants to bless us abundantly. It's not, you know, and that's just not us, but it's our descendants. They get to walk in the fruitfulness of the seeds that we've sown. So, and I think many in this season, God is going to change your name. We're going to talk about that tomorrow too. God changes our name for his benefit, okay? But we need to grow into that nature of who we are, okay? Because I saw myself one way and now I had to see myself as a princess. And you know what? Is he not the prince of peace? Are we not supposed to be his princess? Okay, be blessed till next time.